and welcome to Heavy Rain, day two here on the channel. Sorry about being a little bit late. Push the gas back, because I was getting up and uh, still trying to wake up, really. So. I'll try to get as many tasks as we can get done. It does look like a bat. More like a fox. A crab. A crab. It looks like two, two Grim Reapers. <laughs> I have the results of your MRI scans. Everything seems to be normal. There is no physical damage from the accident. However, I am worried about your psychological condition. I know it's not easy, but you've got to start over, Ethan. You're not responsible yeah. for what happened. It's my fault Jason is dead. That's easy for you to say. He'll be alive if I've been looking out for him. It was an accident. Accidents happen every day. You can't blame yourself forever for your son's death. How is Sean? He's a very solitary kid, you know, very focused within himself. He's really close to his mother. With me, he's more distant. Yeah. And what about That's you? felt more distant. What do you feel? I no longer want to live. I have no reason to continue. Not even for your son, Sean. I couldn't say Jason. Oh, well, I didn't. So really want anything to do with him? Is there something else you wanted to tell me, Ethan? No. No. Can we always do this? That's the end of this session. Uh, we'll continue this conversation next week. I think what well, the which square that was that does square yeah, yeah, to survive such a traumatic accident. I don't exactly feel lucky, Doctor. Things go to school today. I was punished because I didn't do my homework. Yeah, uh, sorry. Sorry about that. Next time, we'll really put together, okay? Is something the matter, Sean? No, I'm all right. Aren't you going to go play with the other kids? I don't feel like it. Do you want to eat something? I haven't been on a seesaw in a long time. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> 
What about that merry-go-round? Well, I bet I can push you so fast you won't be able to stay on it. Push that in there. I pushed it, come on. Come on, game! Dude, damn. I don't want to play that game anymore. I'd like a packet of strawberry flavored chewy cake. Yeah. I think I should get the chocolate. Thanks. It was nice of you anyway. It's for Matrix, baby. Looks like rain's coming. I think you better go. Okay. What the ever does rain? Sometimes I wish everything could just be the way it was before. Me too, Sean. Me too. I live in, live in Seattle. All the rain. Hey, Dad, 
Can I have a ride on the carousel? Can I? Sure. Go pick a horse and get on. I'll get a ticket. I don't get shot, but... Again, the seven balance also what load it should be. Music damn gets it we're not able to hear that. I was got any idea how to fix this shit and tell me. I think you do whatever. We'll have to Do you think it's going to take long? No, he should be finished soon.
Right, this looks must look weird to have everybody else in the station. I say. Stretching it. Tagging along, we can talk as we walk. Yeah, of course. I wanted to introduce myself before getting started, but uh, perhaps there's a better. No, time. no, now it's fine. I just have to get to the press conference. We have. Hey, Jaden, are you coming or what? I haven't got all day. See my assistant. We'll talk later. The body of Jeremy Bowles was found this morning on a patch of wasteland in the East End at about 6.30 a.m., five days after he was reported missing. An autopsy will be conducted tomorrow to determine the exact cause of death, but going from first indications, it would seem that he drowned. The state in which the body was found suggests the methodology of the origami killer. The investigation should confirm this in the coming days. The police are continuing to work around the clock to find the murderer as quickly as possible. I'll field some questions. Yes. You said the methodology indicated another victim for the origami killer. Can you be more specific? An origami figure was found in the victim's hand, and an orchid was placed on his chest. His face was covered with mud, but there were no visible traces of violence to the body. Go ahead. Uh, the Zodiac Killer was never identified. Perhaps the origami killer will never be found either. <laughs> I don't think there's much chance of that. For the moment, the killer may think he's invulnerable, but in the end he'll make a mistake and we'll be there to arrest him. Yes? No. Uh, he has not made contact in any way, and we have only the murders to help us understand his motives. Yes. What's the question? Some people are saying that the police were slow to take an interest in these murders because the victims lived in poor parts of the city. What do you say to that? That's absurd. The police make no distinctions between victims based on their social class. It is true that the origami killer seems to choose his victims from the more impoverished parts of town. The higher crime rate in these areas makes the investigation more difficult. Time for a couple more. Yes. There are rumors that the FBI has sent a profiler to help with the investigation. Is that true? You seem to be well informed. Yes, we asked the FBI yeah, well, to, press, the nice. to help us with this investigation. Nice to us. We were planning to announce this in the next few <laughs> days, but it seems that won't be necessary. Yeah. Regardless of died. P. 
pure speculation. At no time has the mayor been involved in this investigation, except to support the efforts of the police force, of course. The mayor will give him a fake news. Thank you for your cooperation. One last question. Captain Perry, one more question, please. I'm ready to start. Maybe we should kick off by talking about the case? I have some work to finish here. Let's talk about that later, if you don't mind. Okay. Uh, no problem. Just let me know when you're available. Fair <laughs> coffee. Offer to our new lieutenants. We bought the same model each year for the past 20 years for each promotion. It optimizes everybody's time and it's the kind of thing that always goes down well. You can contribute to our fund if you like, we're still a few dollars short. I'll be, nice guy. I'll be sure to do that, sir. Captain Perry said you could show me to my office? Yes, of course. Follow me. Looks like this office has been using years. That's where I was told to take you. If you need anything, you know where to find me. Okay, time to work. That could be important info about a case that was solved 20 years ago. Step one, change the office.
Under the sea. Chevrolet Very good probability. And that is just percent, and that's. Just one origami store in town. Mm, a common species. That doesn't help much. No, it doesn't. The orchid is a common species. It can be found at any flower shop. It really doesn't help. Do that. I said open. Don't open, open it. Freaking win. Definitely not what I wanted to do. 
I did not do that! I am pushing up. You asked me to. Again, this is just the problem with these different motion controls. It's so freaking unresponsive on what no, it's a I am pushing open. I am pushing open! I am What the fuck? What the fuck? There's nothing else to do. Don't let me freaking out. How the fuck do you get that by going up? I am going upwards and right over the angle. Come on! Come on! Come on! No, that's not what I did! Ack! when I'm pushing upwards. Please explain that to me. I am going up and you're... I'm not even going to the right. I am pushing to the left. What the fuck is with this thing? Even Ugh. I am pushing up. I did not push the right at all. What the fuck? I am. I am.
trying everything it just freaking does anything but what I'm doing there we go finally all boys age between 9 and 13 no signs of violence the victims disappear from public places in broad daylight. No one notices anything. Bodies are found three to five days later. Drowned in rainwater. There is always a railroad line adjacent to where the bodies are found. And all the victims disappeared in the fall. The killer has a large comfort zone. He gained confidence rapidly and moved away from his base. Hmm, this won't make the geo profiling any easier. That no one. Always the same ritual. An origami in the hand, an orchid on the chest. The victims have always been dead for less than six hours when they were found, which means they remained alive for several days before being drowned. Over 3,500 people questioned, over 100 suspects interrogated. Not a single lead to go on. Yeah, like cases like that, like this, this can happen. The killer is white, age between 30 and 45. He is intelligent, calm, and determined. An organized type. He has a car. He's probably employed, but his work allows him free time. Here we go again. I better go wash my face. I need to take some. I'm gonna faint if I resist. That's all right. I know I can make it. I know. I know I can make it. Dude, you got problems. Sands. This is Lieutenant Blake, Mr. Marshall. Could you please tell him what happened? It, it was this afternoon. I went to the park with my son, Sean. We played together for a while. And then he wanted to go on the carousel, so I put him on one of the wooden horses. And when I turned back, Sean had disappeared. Exactly what time did you arrive at the park? Try to remember exactly, Mr. Mars. Every detail can be important. It must have been about...
4.45, I think. I'm not really sure. What was your son wearing when he disappeared? He was wearing a coat. A black coat. And a pair of pants. Beige pants. How could Sean have disappeared without you even noticing? Weren't you right by the carousel? I... I can't remember exactly. It all happened so fast. You say you took your son to the park after school. But you didn't report him missing until 8.15. Why did it take you so long to contact the police? I searched the whole neighborhood for him. I, I thought he couldn't have gone far. All right. That's all the questions I have for now. You're free to go, Mr. Mars. I did search for him. Sean overnight. We'll contact you if we have any more questions. Do, do you think the origami killer... Listen, your son's probably just run off and he'll turn up in a couple hours. But what if it is the origami killer? Well, then we have about four days to find him alive. Find something? No, nothing yet, but they're gonna keep looking through the night. Do they do they think it's the origami killer? It, it, it's still too early to say. But it is a possibility. Oh, Jason, you had to go there. Oh, that's what you meant to say. So, my name's Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. Uh, I'm investigating the case of the origami killer. I I'd like to ask you a few questions. My son is dead, Mr. Shelby. I have nothing more to say. I also lost some time. I know what you're feeling. Then you will understand that I do not wish to talk about it. The killer has kidnapped another victim. A ten-year-old boy. Like your son, Risa. 
I have four days before we find his body on a deserted stretch of waste. No one did anything to save my son. Now, please, to move along, sir. Hey, Jared. Hey, do you sell inhalers? I'm all out, and at least I won't go away completely empty-handed. In the back of this door, to the right. Thanks. Or something in particular. Give me what you got in the register. Don't fucking try anything. Open the register, you dumb fuck. Put the money on the counter. Shit, are you deaf or what? Are you gonna open that fucking register or not? No, sir. You do not have the right to steal that money from me. I have worked very hard to earn it. You cannot have it. What did you say? You're out of your fucking mind, man! You don't get it, do you? I'm gonna put a fucking bullet right between your eyes if you don't do what I say now! Don't turn around. Shall not be robbing my Let's registers. Go. Hey, you! Come here! I said come here now! Don't move! Hands up! Put your fucking hands up or I'll shoot! Look, it's not worth it. Put the gun down and just walk away. You giving me advice? I'll give you some fucking advice. Don't panic. Let's just stay calm. Nobody here wants to hurt you. Uh, we're all just gonna be cool and everything will be all right. Yeah. yeah. I'm cool, man. Everything's gonna be all fucking right. You don't really want to shoot anybody, do you? I'm sure we can find a way out of this mess, right? Uh, my name's Scott. What about you? What's your name? Andrew. My name's Andrew. Do you have anyone you care for in your life? A, a girlfriend, maybe? A family? Yeah. A little girl. That's right, Demo. I got a little girl. Her name is Jessica. What would Jessica think if she saw you here? Ask yourself, what would happen to her if things go wrong? You haven't done anything serious yet. If you put the gun away, you'll forget about what just happened, and that will be the end. Just walk away. Nothing serious. Shit, man! What the fuck do you think I'm doing here? Nice try. For a second there, you almost had me believing all your shit. And now... What would have happened if you had not been well, here? This I didn't come by for nothing. Have a nice day. When my boy, Razor, disappeared, I received a letter with a locker ticket inside. Inside the locker, I found this box. I do not understand what it means, but I think it must be a sort of message from the man who took my son from me. Can I? Bad paper lizard. Any use to you at all. 
did not help me to save Reza. But maybe it will help you find the other little boy. Thank you. Mr. Shelby. I was beginning to think that there was no good to be found in this place. I can see now that I was wrong. And we're just gonna leave the guy there. Yeah, that'll go wrong. We have some coffee. It's a confusion guy out there.
Feeling like we're doing South Park, he's every toilet. Yeah, ma'am. There was an open when we left in the bathroom. There's someone here. There's someone, There's someone in the apartment. The phone on the desk. I could call for help. The front door. It's the only way out. If I can reach it, I still have a chance. Using Jason teleportation powers. Okay, now that's multiple of them, okay. Makes more sense.
cheap game, real cheap. Like the new bonus. So what that is. Wednesday, seven thirty one AM of our entering. When the parents came home from church, all their children were gone. They searched and called for them, they cried and begged, but it was all to no avail. The children have never been seen again. I have to get out of here and find out what this ticket is about. Somebody looking at us, even us. Gonna, gonna have to make it through the crowd. I can't, can't take crowds. Just can't handle it. Yeah, boy. I, I can't make it. Too many people. Too many people. Sure, I wouldn't. I didn't. I 
pushed it. It didn't do anything. It pushed our went. Not working. That's supposed to work. I don't know. Just pushing our one is that fucking helping. So the. It's your turn this. Got a Jason button.
Line 18, box number 3. Yeah, it's a box. That's like the other thing that. Victim, uh, that's victim of Victor Father. At random. Okay, to show you cards to save some Joe's garage parking lot for ninety eight. Save someone you love. I kind of figures each figure is a trial. Each trial provides players layers reveal one address.
You're like, they're bonus. Eh. Oh, the bonus means in this game. Killer is white, aged between 30 and 45. He doesn't act on impulse, but plans his crimes in a very meticulous fashion. He doesn't have anything personal against the victims. That's why he covers their faces with mud, to make them anonymous. Why does he kill them if he doesn't have anything against them? For him, they're more of an image, a symbol. That's probably why he gives them an origami figure and an orchid as gifts, to apologize for what he's done to them. Very interesting. Where does all that get us? The best way of tracking a predator is to be familiar with his behavior. That may be true in novels, but this way you can figure out what how he does he stuff. One detail attracted my attention. The interval between the time when a victim disappears and the time when the body is found ranges from three to five days. The rainfall is always at six inches, give or take ten percent. What on earth does that mean? All the victims are drowned in rainwater. The killer kills only in the fall when there is plenty of rain. It could be that he puts them in some sort of well or tank that is open to the skies and that fills up with rainwater. The more it rains, the less time the victim has to live. Then I studied the geographical distribution of the murders. Generally, a killer commits his first murder near to where he lives, so he has a safe place to flee to if any complications arise. The more confident he becomes, the further he roams from his base. By analyzing the locations where the victims disappeared, I was able to isolate a zone where the killer might live. And what size is this, uh, zone? For the moment, about ten square miles. Great. Must be 10,000 people living in that sort of area. You gonna question them one by one? Dude. It may not give us the address of the killer. Before this, we had even a larger You've got a better plan. range. I'm willing to listen. Don't be shy. I'm all ears. So what's next? There are two suspects whose psychological profile might fit and can be connected to the comfort zone. I'd like to question them. Damn it. We're wasting our time with this bullshit. The killer's out there somewhere, and we gotta get off our asses and find him. That's how he does it. Blake, I've had just about enough of your shit. You've been chasing this guy for what? Two years? Or what do you caught, huh? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Well, you think you can do a better fucking job than me with your psychology degree and your great glasses? Well, let me tell you something, pal. That don't mean zip when it comes to getting out there. You're just a fucking bureaucrat. You're just an asshole. Your vast experience hasn't prevented eight victims from being murdered. <laughs> That's enough. said it took six inches of rainfall before the victim died. How much time do we have left? If the weather forecasts are right, less than 72 hours. Yeah, boy. I'm gonna take a little break here. Work it down and uh back in the stay for a moment.
and we're back. Alright. Here we go. Waste our time here. Maybe we should have a little look inside anyway. There's nobody home. There is now. I'm not sure that's entirely legal. Call the cops. Looks like Nathaniel Williams is a pretty religious guy. He's a God-fearing God idiot, idiot, waiting for the end of the, the world. End of the world. We questioned him a few months back because he was causing a disturbance in the park. He was ranting and raving. Said he heard voices. Had this idea in his sick little head that I was the Antichrist. I had come to Earth to persecute him. Real it does sound a little bit... Odd. Lots of mess and uh, lots of items. Stifling in here. Those windows haven't been opened in years. All the signs of a mystical obsessive neurosis compounded by a persecution complex. The guys taking a break from reality hold up here in this crazy apartment. You don't have to be a profiler to see he's not a killer. We're wasting our time here. Yeah. What kind of guy would... I'm like, just, uh, very mistake. Good timing, Nathaniel. Just the man we're looking for. Angels and ministers of grace defend us. I'm Agent Norman Jaden, FBI. I'd like to ask you a few questions. As God is my witness, I haven't done anything. I'm innocent. Relax. Nobody's accusing you of anything. You just yeah, no excuse me, Eric. Nathaniel, do you remember where you were last Tuesday at 4.30 p.m.? Here. I was here. I was praying. All day. Was there anybody with you? No, I was alone. Why all the crucifixes? You afraid of something? The hour is nigh, and the wrath of God shall strike men down. I'm preparing for the end of the world. Where do you work, Nathaniel? You have a job? My sole occupation is praying to the all-merciful Lord for the salvation of humanity. What about the voices, Nathaniel? Do you still hear the voices? We know who talks to you, don't we, Nathaniel? Or we both know who talks to you. Don't speak that name. What does he say to you, Nathaniel? Blake, what are you doing? I can't talk about it. You mustn't talk about it. He orders That's you to enough. go and find Leave new prey, does he? He needs more and more. There's a bike is out of control. No! You mustn't mention him. You'll bring him here. 
Curse. He told you to go Shit. and find that kid Get in the park. Your mind. The voices tormented you all night long. You wanted them to stop, didn't you, Nathaniel? Stop! Stop! That's enough! So you obeyed them to make them stop. You took that boy with you and you drowned him. Isn't that right? No! Stop! Stop! You killed them, didn't you, Nathaniel? Are you gonna confess, you bastard? Stop, Blake. You are the Antichrist. Put down the gun, I Nathaniel. I shall watch you to your father in hell. He is the son of Satan. He was sent to earth to destroy Shoot, us. For Christ's sake, shoot! Calm down, Nathaniel. Nobody here wants to hurt you. Put the gun down. Lieutenant Blake is gonna leave our planet right now and return to the what? realm of shadows. Creature of darkness, I do beseech you to return to the realm of shadows and leave our Nathaniel in peace. Team. You shall regret confronting the emissary of the Lord. You shall know divine power. I'm here to help you, Nathaniel. To get rid of the voices in your head. But you have to trust me. Christ, all powerful. Defend us in our battle with the forces of evil. Protect us from the cunning and wiles of the demon. May God Almighty manifest the power of his empire. And may divine power cast Satan and all the other spirits that prowl the world in search of souls into the darkest depths of hell. Now gently put the gun down on the floor. Back away, slowly. Drop the gun. Drop it, Nathaniel. Yeah, drop it, Nathan. We don't want to. <laughs> Put your hands on your head. Turn around. Motherfucker! The curse effects. I exorcise thee, Satan. Okay, Frank, the show's over. You're under arrest. Pretty damn Still cool a under circumstances. I would have just shot him. A gun isn't the answer to every problem, Blake. Yeah. Took a tuck guy down. Most of the time it helps. Uh, opportunities to Self-control trophy. 37 a.m. One point. Out of four inches. Scum. Wait. Tell like it's it's till he knows there's gonna be a lot of rain. But it doesn't give people there the enough a lot of Is, um, 
I get lucky. This is old. Anybody home? Yourself. Uh -huh. I'm going to call an ambulance. No, I, I don't want to go to the hospital, please. Okay. You got something around here I can dress this wound with? Yeah, I think so. Okay, don't move. I'll be right back. Let's see. <laughs> I need this, and this, and this. Yeah, the band needs. Ah, it's a little bit. I'm here for you, Susan. You'll be all right. I'll take care of you. And that hurts, but... Trust me. I heard the pressure that either... The either the blood will stop. care of the baby. Okay? Do you know what to do? With a baby, I mean. I'm a private eye. There's nothing I can't do. <laughs> Her name That's a thank you. Gotcha. Said, ah, I got a kid. Alright, to take care of my bells. My brothers and sisters. Yeah. 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 Hi there, Emily. Hello, sweet. Hello. What seems to be the problem, huh? Oh. Going by the smell, I got a pretty good idea.
Oh, this is gonna be messy. Okay. I guess I better warm this thing up. My technology. A baby warmer, bowel warmer. Didn't know this existed. That's a new thing. Try eleven there somewhere in there. Yeah. Oh, Emily, are you hungry? Hmm? You hold on. I'll just tilt this part a little bit. Hey, so my my nut uh, my youngest nephew is still baby you're still parming up old fashioned ways. Oh, sweetie. You gotta break all kinds of boys. That's one thing, aren't Dakota. Come on. Come on. Ugh. That's what I'm going to prompt away. Good little girl. Thank you. 
Thanks for looking after my baby. I didn't want to leave her. I just couldn't cope anymore. Just not having Jeremy around. He was such a good boy. I can't understand why anyone would want to hurt him. Do you take care of this baby on your own? Doesn't Jeremy's father live with you anymore? He disappeared. The day after Jeremy. I don't know what happened to him. Maybe... Maybe he couldn't take it. Ever since I've had to look after Emily all on my own and... I couldn't do it anymore. I understand. <coughs> Did your husband say anything before he disappeared? Did he leave a note or something? No. He left the house without a word and... That sucks. There was just a cell phone. A cell phone? Yeah, I, I found a cell phone in his dresser. I'm sure... It wasn't his. I'd never seen it before. Oh, I man. I it on, but it didn't work. Do you still have it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's in a drawer in the living room. You can have it if you'd like. I'm sure it's of more use to you than to me. Give me a surprise. Anybody to help you? Yeah. My mother. I didn't want to ask her for anything. We don't really get along. But I guess I'm out of options. Well, look after yourself. And Emma. I will. I promise. Underneath the mass. Good luck, Emily. You take care of your mom. Wednesday and get them. And man, it is really random. I made the CL jump. <laughs> man, it was raining there. A couple weeks ago, just like it's just rained for several days. It's the only. Everyone stop.
I'd like to get my car. Damn, his dad must have not passed the trial. Save his kid. That's why he left. Guessing. Hey, you're a pretty patient guy, you are. That car's been there for two years. We took it out for a drive every month to check the tires and batteries, just like you said. Here, it's the third floor down. The service elevator is in the far end of the town. Thanks. Ah, oh, you have yourself a good one, Chief. Going up. We're going down. Your destination is four miles from here. Leave the parking lot and take the first right. Hey, boy. This is dangerous. If I succeed, I'll get more letters for the hangar. It's my only lead. No turning back now. Yeah, it's not turning back. I can do it. I'd do anything to save my son. There goes nothing. Go the wrong way on the highway for five miles? Am I willing to take that risk in order to save my son? Yeah. A lot of good it'll do Sean if I kill myself on this highway. I've got to do it, for Sean's sake. I have no choice. You're going the wrong way!
that shit. The atmosphere here is one of concern, as there is still no news of 10-year-old Sean Mars, who disappeared yesterday. Hey, killer. The disinformation is confirmed. He may still be alive, as the previous heart. were all killed for five days after their abduction. I'd like a room. Obviously, time is running out for fast. you. Anything. Feeling the red just I see <laughs> what a creep. Madison, page twenty seven, single. How long will you be staying with us, Miss Page? I don't know yet. Round 201. Last floor, stairs on the right, in the courtyard. Thanks. The pleasure was all mine. That's for sure. Uh, dipshit. my room it's number 207 
you're really in bad shape, you should see a doctor. Must have one, maybe two broken ribs. It's not fatal. <laughs> but it's sore as hell. Your head is bleeding. It looks deep. I should disinfect his cuts. I should disinfect his cuts. I'm gonna disinfect it's disgusting a little. This might hurt a little. I won't get infected. Thanks. <laughs> Necofrin 100 antibiotics administered to combat infection. Here, take this. It should do you some good. What is it? It's an antibiotic. An antibiotic? I'm no doctor, but I don't think there's any risk of infection with a broken rib. Okay, I'll see if I can find anything else. <laughs> that was a try. Paracamol painkiller. Administer in cases of intense pain. Do not take more than one pill every 24 hours. Oh, he's definitely a lot of pain. Take this. It should do you what some good. It? It's a pain Painkiller. Pain It'll help reduce the pain. It says on the box to take one every 24 hours. I don't Ain't know if to see the dose. I can't afford to wait. I wouldn't move around for a few days if I were you. Uh, I'm going to take a shower. Let me help you. I'll wait here until you come out. Let me know if you need anything. Sweet. What's your name? Madison. Are you staying in the hotel? No, I live in town. I suffer from chronic insomnia. I seem to only be able to sleep in motels. Don't ask me why. Whenever I get too exhausted, I, uh, I come and spend a night here. I'm... I'm just passing through. And what else do you do, Madison? Apart from fixing up strangers. I'm a photographer. I take pictures of uh, furniture for fashionable design magazines. And you? I... I'm an architect. Thanks for staying. I feel a lot better now. Okay. I better get going then. By the way, you never told me your name. Ethan. 
Be careful, Ethan. to control either, man. Why didn't you shoot? Sorry? But back there, Nathaniel could have had a gun. Could have killed me. Why didn't you shoot? I prefer to have all the information before I make a decision. I try to make rational choices when possible. Come on, you had a fraction of a second to react. You could have whacked me before you had time to move. You're alive, he's behind bars, everything worked out. So don't start busting my balls with your postmodels, okay? That's him. Why does it always always think it's a good idea to um, Eric's after him. Push it, man. That's perfect, baby. That's the top of that. Chickens. in case did
Also assaulting a police officer. Either way, no. This time it looks like we got our origami killer. Seems a good place to end for the day. Uh, we're gonna be back. Uh, so someone tell you we're gonna be in the, about the half hour. So, instead of trying to continue more chapters, so this is enough for be be fine place to end. We're gonna be back. Excuse me. Tomorrow, I'm gonna be back tomorrow. Men. And I'll fell 17 in the afternoon. And then, tomorrow morning, I'll cur cur eat with you. And tomorrow night. And then on Monday and Tuesday, get down with heavy rain. Of course, that would work. Sorry, something was just. I'm just gonna look at something. Tuesday, get out, we have a rain. Wednesday, it'll be Wednesday, it'll be shows 18, but a special time because we're celebrating the 4th of July. If there's so, uh, 4th of July, it'll be celebration. It'll be on Wednesday at 12 30. Thursday, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe racing with the Great TQ. Thursday night, get down on the heavy rain. Thursday and Friday, six Saturday will not be guests. Because I was like all the movies. But yeah, that's the upcoming schedule. New channel, like the NFL, but we got lots of games coming. We get down on heavy rain, try not to get the worst innings. <laughs> also, we screwed up a little bit so far. Hopefully, we won't screw up so bad. Well, the worst inning. <laughs> But, uh, we also got coming up in uh, July. We got Kingdom Hearts Retain of Memories. And uh, August, Red Dead Redemption. In September, we got a uh, Shadow Tomb Raider. October, we're doing a Halloween a thon. Dedicate 19, Spider Man November. All kinds of good stuff coming up. I see all the scheduled stuff coming up in the next couple of months. Go look at the uh, upload down there. Depending on where you are. Um, right here, depending on where you want to look at Twitch, because you get the events page up, up or any events page down below. Well, it's the upcoming schedule and channels. So follow me on social media so you want to go live or the go live, but we've seen the answering all kinds of games from Ghost Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Speaking of YouTube, subscribe to my YouTube page for all the playthroughs, past better feature, including our playthrough. Including all the playthroughs we've played uh, so far this year, including um, uh, Brain Fart. <laughs> uh, I 
God of War 2, Halo 4, um, Uncharted the Lost Legacy, Titanfall 2, uh, and lots more. Got backs and videos, reaction videos, lots, all kinds of good stuff, including, including what if we, <laughs> got an ultra version that we're going to be starting and continuing. What if, uh, actually, what if I got, uh, Tuesday, uh, Wednesday, we're going to be actually going to be starting out a new team uh, for, for Shomo, which you can see how they all went down on the five stacks right now. But, there's going to be an exclusive version where I didn't get traded to, to the Cleveland Indians who stayed in Miami. Give me a few tubes. But yeah. And if you want to help the cast out, there's some ways in the world to save your money. Make good progress today. I got a lot more chapters than I thought we would. And I guess go back and do that one. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, let's see. see. But yeah, that is going to be it, like I said, for the yeah, make of progress. Get to us on Monday. Tomorrow, like I said, we made an NFL 17 or work a Wii U edition on tomorrow night. So until next time, have a good one, everyone.